Hey Shibi Doodlers, how are you doing? Today I'm going to show you how to draw a really simple face. Now I have made this guide here which you can download from my website. Uh, if you go to shirena.com slash courses you'll find it there somewhere. There's a link in the description box down below which makes it a little bit easier. And you can either download this one or you can download this sort of multiple one. Now this uh, video is the first in a series that I'm going to do on drawing faces and the idea is to show how very very simply you can create characters all based on the same kind of very simple plan and so I've drawn the chin and drawn in the ears I'm just going to do a little kind of wiggle in the ears there and then I'm going to start oh that's 12 o'clock about half past one I suppose no. and I'm going to draw a curve and 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 a curve down there and then here I'm going to draw a curve following down about there and come out a little way there and we're going to get up and around sort of straightish across there and then kind of curve it around and we're going to do the same here and just sort of curve around it there we maybe put a couple of <laughs> loose bits like that and then I'm going to draw the sort of hairy bits to give you a feeling of the way the hair is combed sort of like that and we're just going to do sort of one maybe make that a bit bigger there and we want to kind of follow the the curve there as well so that's the hair and now I'm going to draw the eyes so this is going to be a boy so I'm going to make the eyes a little distance from each other and they're kind of like a letter C uh, so it's just the pupils. The pupils have, you know, shiny bits. You know, if if you're alive, <laughs> then you have nice shiny eyeballs. And that's what this little white bit is inside. So that's why we don't just draw a black blob. Leave a little bit of white in there as well. And we're going to draw some nice happy eyebrows and a cute little nose. So being a boy, the nose would be quite sort of high up to the ear, uh, eyes. And then we're going to draw a, just a happy little smile like that. Very, very simple. And then I'm going to draw a neck. Join those two lines with a curve. So to come around there like a sausage. And then we'll draw some shoulders. And we don't want them to be terribly wide. He's just a boy. <laughs> he hasn't been sort of pumping iron and building up muscles and then a little wiggle there it's like a little bee isn't it and then that will give you the folds in the armpits and look you've got eyebrows eyes nose and mouth it's like the face is a sheet of paper and you're writing on it with with these eyebrows eyes nose and mouth and they're like letters that go to make up a word and you can use the same letters rearranged to make different words that have different meanings and similarly, you can rearrange uh, these elements to create different expressions. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button and ring the bell so you get notified every time I upload new videos to help you improve your creative skills. So let's draw him again over here just to show you what I mean. And this is what I'm going to be doing in, um, in this series is <laughs> doing a couple of versions of the same character with different expressions so that you can kind of see what I mean. So we've drawn the chin. I've gone a bit low there, so it's going to be a bit more pointy. See, <laughs> I've gone above here, so it's a bit flat, and that's a bit more pointy. You, you need to practice. I'm talking at the same time. Um, we'll draw the eyes. Oh, I did the eyes last, last, last time, didn't I? But never mind. Let's draw the eyes there. Um, starting about 1.30 on the clock. I'm going to come around. I'm okay with that a little. This can be a little bit of an S. And I'm going to give <laughs> these little kind of flicks this time just to make it a bit more elegant. And maybe a little flick down there. But we'll do the same up here. We'll go up and around and sort of down and up and around and down. A couple of little flicks. And we'll go up, two, three, like that. <laughs> One, two, three, like that. And then we'll put a couple in there, like that. 
Now, this time I'm going <laughs> to give him some serious eyebrows and also keep the nose nice and high like that. And I can give him a, a sort of a sausage shape. All I'm doing there is the shadow under the bottom lip. Don't worry about lips. Lips are really difficult things to draw, so forget about them. Just draw a shape for the mouth and a little shadow underneath the bottom lip. And here, this time, I'm going to make him a little bit more aggressive. So I'm going to lose the neck altogether, because when you're kind of angry, you see my shoulders kind of went up. So we'll move his shoulders sort of up like that. So he's more kind of being aggressive and sort of coming towards you. <laughs> and we'll do that little kind of bee thing there, like that. And it's the same boy, but two different attitudes aren't they so let's oh i should have zoomed in earlier but never mind so there you are and i'm calling this boy michael m-i-c-h-a-e-l and you can draw him as many times as you like it it doesn't matter how many times you draw try doing sort of rearranging the face a bit bring the eyes closer together the nose down see what happens uh, it's really interesting if you do and as i say there's this other page here that you can do uh, which has uh, 16 little things on there so you can really practice those so there you are thanks for watching come back next time for another face another character and in the meantime keep drawing 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 practice 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 and i'll see you next time you take care now bye bye